Keep going forward. Yep. Okay, that's excellent. Best one here today. Okay, so um, some of the animals aren't really totally rare, but they may be vulnerable. Yeah. And this is the case for the animal that I'm giving you as a friend. Some of them look friendly and cuddly, but others can be a bit scary, but don't, with Jock, take no, their no, hands they're, away. No, no, they're all important in their own way. Oh, cool. So what you've got is a uh, print of a tusked frog. With the Art Snack Cafe, we've got um, a broader title, which is uh, Anima at the Art Snack Cafe. And the anima is the life of the animal, and um, uh, you can give some life to that image. It looks very still there and frozen, but if you move your fingers gently underneath, you can give a sense of life within the animal. And it can be an art form as to just how you make the animal come to life. I was saying to some people that um, they could spend a few hours here if they liked and just practice what they're doing. So the, the, the person who receives the print becomes a bit like a puppeteer. Instead of pulling strings, it's not like drifting sands. It's just breathing at the moment. Yes. So your hands are well placed to um, animate a lot of the, the form of the frog. develops, there's a bit of anxiety in the frog. Yeah, he's anxious. Heart beats, his face caves in. Yeah. And uh, just as in life we, we live, we breathe, but we wear out. It's, and, uh, yeah, it's hap hap happening in your hands. Turn into a... <laughs> it's interesting to see how people respond to the image and make it come alive. Disappearing. Mm. It's unfortunate it's happening with so many in terms of losing their habitat or yeah. food sources or competing mm. with invasive species. Yeah. So it's sort of incredible threats. Mm. Sometimes I feel as though it should at a certain point draw a curtain around as you have some private time with your mm. print. It gets you to notice things about the frog too. And mottling. And I have one screen of um, a swamp crayfish. Oh yeah. And they're, they're only about an inch long and I do the print that size on people's hands and I always sense that there's going to be a disappointment with receiving something that's small but on the same screen I have a larger image and then I mm. print the larger image. Benches. On benches and yes. Yes. Yeah, so um, I do um, these prints, these ephemeral prints. They um, have different meanings with the context in which they're done.